we're asked this question so often and sometimes a marketing tool is called crm in gaming or, or the pam is called your crm in gaming or your audience segmentation tool is called your 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 crm it, a true crm is is the ability to have actionable data so if you look at your back office gaming system the igts and the the net ends and whatever they provide it, it's the spins wins deposits etc cetera, etc cetera. All that data is super important. That that's what the player is doing, um, but it comes into a cent uh, back office as such, a system of record we call it in Salesforce, and it's a bit static. What Salesforce does is a layer of engagement um, in, in what we call this customer experience layer, is the ability to make that data actionable. So now, as as the player, let's say, um, has deposited money and it hasn't come through into their account. If I call through as a player, or if I go through the chat, or if I send a WhatsApp message, the agent on the other end will be able to have visibility of who that player is. Is the player VIP? Is the player a responsible gambler? Uh, is, is the player a potential fraud risk? That, so th that data is crucially important that isn't really kept in, in that back office. But also the ability to see that player has availed of a promotion on the bonus engine um, weekly for the past year, but last week didn't avail of it. You know, so whilst I'm managing a ticket because my, my deposit hasn't gone through, I, I as an agent can do this kind of snowball customer service effect, manage that first time case resolution because we've access to the data from the, the back office to say that deposit was done then, we understand it, we'll get to resolution, but also understanding why aren't you availing of that bonus over here, which you normally do. So it, it's lots of moving parts in our system of engagement. Um, and I hope that was clear, Kate.